An evacuation order has been lifted for Tracy, Rosa Pollock and five other properties in Pemberton by Airport Road. On Tuesday, the floodwaters came close to her hangar and offices. Luckily, there was no damage and by the next day, levels had dropped. Well, it was pretty high, like around the, uh, the hangar and offices. It was, didn't quite get in, but it was quite high and quite close. But uh, today it looks, it looks better, yeah. How do you feel now? Yep, better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a bit of a relief, but we'll see what happens with the rain now. Dozens of properties in Pemberton and in the Squamish Lillooet Regional District remain under an evacuation alert after heavy rains hit the area, causing creeks and the Lillooet River to rise. This is an unusual situation for us to have this sort of event in January. This is fairly typical for October and for spring. Uh, but this is this is unusual for January. Typically, we would be fr uh, frozen and under snow right now. And um, and so this warm temperature is is certainly concerning for us. The water levels have gone down. Residents are not out of danger yet. Rain and snow melt with warmer temperatures are expected. The forecast does look favorable in that it's not heavy rains, but it's not entirely predictable. So at this point, we're going to watch the weather over the next 24, 48 hours. That means more alerts or orders could be issued in the coming days. Grace Key, Global News.